In a first of its kind order, the Supreme Court today overturned the results of the Chandigarh mayoral poll, setting aside the initial results and declaring the AAP candidate the winner. The top court held that the returning officer, Anil Masi, had deliberately and unlawfully invalidated eight votes and is liable to face contempt action. Ahmadvi Party Chief Arvind Kejriwal reacted post the verdict, verdict, calling it a win for democracy and a victory for the India bloc. India got a big deal. The first deal is a big deal and a big deal is a big deal. One way, we have to take them from the people. They have to take them from the people. They have to take them from the people. But we have not to take them from the end. We have to fight until the end. And in the end, our win has been made. I am joined by my colleague Sunil Prabhu, who covered the case for us. Sunil, what tilted the proceedings in favour of our Madhmi Party and the Congress, the India bloc for that matter? Bring us the top highlights of the order. Well, right from day one, I think uh, this was uh, waiting to happen. Uh, the fact that we saw, uh, you know, uh, the Supreme Court say there's a murder of democracy, the CCC TV footage uh, very blatantly showing uh, the returning officer, uh, you know, uh, you know, trying to tamper with the uh, uh, ballot paper. And it's in that backdrop, the Supreme Court taking, uh, you know, cognizance of it, asking everything to be sealed. Uh, asking it to be heard and seeing that horse trading is taking place, uh, in, you know, interrogating, cross-examining the returning officer, telling him that he's on oath and yet lying. Now they have uh, taken action against him, asked why uh, show cause notice should not be issued and why he should not be proceeded against. And then going through the entire videograph as well as those ballot papers themselves before de declaring. And this is the first time, please remember, for the first time, a returning officer has been grilled in the Supreme Court by the Chief Justice of India. This is the first time that the Chief Justice of India's bench has decided the election based on what was, you know, what had happened on that uh, uh, fateful day. And it's on that basis that they have declared uh, the Aam Aadmi Party Congress candidate Kuldeep Kumar as elected. Right. Uh, so, so there are a number of us and in this in this uh, case, and it's in, on that basis uh, that the Supreme Court took that decision. Right, Sunil, quickly for our viewers, what's the next course of action as far as the mayor polls are concerned? Of course, the AAP candidate has been declared the winner, but there's, of course, contempt proceedings which are going to be initiated against the presiding officer. That's, of course, will go through the, uh, you know, the, those deliberations. Uh, uh, there have been uh, talks of horse trading that is taking place. We'll have to wait and see whether right. those three guys, how they go forward, what will happen in the... Uh, mayor, uh, you know, whether they'll move a no confidence motion, those are all issues that will have to play out. That's politics. But the ultimately, uh, today, I think the victory is it's a message uh, to the entire country that you cannot tamper with the electoral process. I think that's the most all political parties, be it the ruling party or anybody else. Right. Don't tamper with the electoral process. That's the message from the Chief Justice of India and the Supreme Court. They will interfere uh, right. ahead of the festival of democracy that is going to take place in 2024. Sunil Prabhu there, appreciate you joining us on this top story.